Ray Saunders came into a pandemic ridden world as an encouraging sign of hope last month. We were really excited. Her mom, Haley Saunders, got her second dose of the COVID-19 <laughs> vaccine when she was nine months pregnant. During a routine checkup two weeks ago, Haley asked if her daughter could be tested for antibodies. And we said, that is interesting. Let's uh, let's go ahead and do that. Alan Laird is the director of laboratory services at Southwest Health System in Cortez, where they found out Reese had antibodies. While this is encouraging, there are still some unknowns. I would expect that the antibodies would degrade over time, probably within a few months. But again, we don't really know how long they last. But it really does give me some strange peace of mind, even though I don't know what it means, really. Nine News health expert Dr. Pio Coley says studying vaccinations in pregnant women can be tricky because trials don't want to involve them before knowing how safe a vaccine is. But interestingly enough, in the clinical trials for Moderna and Pfizer, a few pregnant women did sneak in because they happened to be pregnant and they didn't know that they were pregnant and they got the vaccine. And thankfully, they did very well. Dr. Coley says right now, the benefits of getting vaccinated outweigh the risks. That's what Haley thought too. Everybody needs to do what makes sense for them. We have a happy, happy, healthy child, so I have no regrets at all about taking the vaccine. And in a couple of years, Reese will have a pretty cool story to tell. You know, when somebody says, what's a fun fact about you? She can say she was one of the first babies they found that had antibodies and she was on the news. Victoria De Leon, Nine News.